So it's going to be 20 total jerseys, 18 boxes. You know, that'll get us up to 35 for that first weekend of double box. And then we'll be down to 33 going into the 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 Facebook fills, um, the first ones after the reload. So that's pretty good. So like I said, the odds are, are 43, rather. So that's that's where the odds will be. Um, like I said, we're getting them up there. You know, that'll be 45 when we start on that Sunday for the reload. So the odds will be higher. Of course, the price should be cheaper. You know, that first first couple of Facebook fills are great because that's, that's pretty much as cheap as I can get the spots. You know, we're talking about you know, two-thirds of them will probably be, you know, five or six dollar spots. So, I mean, even like I said, the odds aren't terrible, terrible, but I mean, you get a couple spots for five, six dollars each. Um, and then you're able to make a run of some jerseys. Um, forgot to mention that Big Al's hit the second jersey in the box last night was the 30th. He's actually 30 of the boxes or 30 jerseys he's hit just from the pick your player stuff. So, he's hit, like I said last week, he hit the Hit Parade officially licensed jersey, but he's actually hit 30. So some of you guys, James M just hit his second. Like, you know, there's only a couple people that only have one, but most of you have at least two or more. But obviously, Big Al started to pull away. He's been hot. He's hit three jerseys in the last three of the last 12 jerseys, I think, were Big Al. I think he hit one each of the, the double boxes that hit, and he's he's been pretty steady. So, I mean, after having an epic cold streak where he hadn't hit for – 30 or something boxes. He actually has come back strong with a, a vengeance. He's been picking up, you know, jerseys left and right. So good luck to him. Congratulations. Good luck to everybody. Like I said, we'll see how we're going. Obviously we've had a couple people that have been on heaters. I think uh, Mike H has been doing well lately. Devin's been doing well lately. So you guys are, you know, you guys gotta, gotta, gotta knock them out. You know, they've been, they've been hot. So um, we'll see what happens tonight with the, the AJ's uh, treasure chests. So um, everybody is in and paid for. You guys are all good. Um, let me get the sheet up with the the names. You guys know your spots, so it's not anything new. I just have them on the spreadsheet, and then we're gonna actually have them dropped into the randomizer ready. So here we go. Let me picture the names here we got here. Uh, if you need them. Bigger, so it's probably about as big as you need them. Devin in spot one, Skip R, Scott spot two, Ernest in spot three, Dale spot four, Skip in five, CK in six, Dwayne in seven, Devin in eight, Larry V in nine, Skip R again in ten, Derek F in eleven, Big Al in twelve, CK in thirteen, Big Al in fourteen as well, Larry V in fifteen. Devin in 16, Dale in 17, Skip R in 18, Mike H in 19, and to round us out, Thomas M in 20. So there's your 20 spots. We'll randomize the entire list as soon as we have the box open. Um, so we'll, we'll come back to this after we open the box. We'll do that. So let's get back to the box there. Okay. <clears throat> like I said, there's only two boxes. I'm just going to do one, two, three in the front, four, five, six in the back. Uh, it's the easiest way to do it. Just roll the dice for that. Make people the most to roll the dice. But one, two, three in the front, four, five, six in the back. Okay, here you guys. Three, B in the front. So that'll be next week's box. So three it was. One, two, three in the front. Okay, guys. <clears throat> Okay, everybody ready to roll? No serial numbers, obviously just the UPC code sealed. Obviously, April 23, that means people inducted the Hall of Fame last year most likely will not be in there because I don't think they would guess would be in the treasure chest. So um, this is still people they've had from April 2023 of the treasure chest. And obviously, maybe they'll probably do another batch this year to include um, the new people, but we'll see how that goes. So Good luck, everybody. Uh, got your name. We'll do the random. And we got... AJCOM case, of course. 
BGCOA, Hall of Famer, one of the greatest American-born defensemen, Phil Housley on the Buffalo Sabres. The Reebok, how about that one? Phil Housley, one of the highest-scoring defensemen, American-born defensemen, NHL history, Hall of Famer, Phil Housley, Buffalo Sabres. There we go. Very, very nice. Obviously, AJ COA. AJ sticker on the back. There we go. Phil Housley. He was a true, true mobile point scoring defenseman. Phil Housley. There we go. Okay. We got the Phil. We got the Phil. Let's see. Let's see. There we go. There we go. <laughs> Not the again, Latom. Sorry about that. But it is Phil Housley. And correct, he is a Hall of Famer. He is one of the highest scoring defensemen, American board defensemen of all time. He played, I think, more American, more games by any American player, except I think Chelly has probably beat out because Chelly has played till he's what. 50, 60, or whatever. He just has retired number with Chicago. But Housley is definitely one of the top top uh, all-American games played. Um, definitely a top uh, American scoring defenseman. So a definitely a legit Hall of Famer, Phil Housley. You don't see tons of Phil Housleys, at least in the license stuff. So it's nice to see that. Um, we haven't done it yet, Derek. We're going to do the random for who it is now. So um, let's get that up. Let's get our randomizer up, our dice roller again, and our spreadsheet. Okay. Let's get back to that. Okay. So here's the list. All of them are here, 1 through 20, all your numbers, you guys' claims. And we're going to do five or more, and then we're going to randomize the list. So we'll decide the person at the top will be the winner. Seven times. So seven times we have everybody here on the list in order, 1 through 20. Everybody is in order. So we have seven times. The person at the top after seven will be the winner of the Phil Housley. So let's do it. Five, seven times. Two, three, four, five, six. And the winner of the Housley jersey will be, boom, Larry V. Congratulations, Larry V. You got a bit of a heater, too. Larry V. Not necessarily his Boston guys, but you got the Buffalo guys. So, congratulations, Larry V. On the seven times, Larry V at the top for the Phil Housley. Congratulations, fine, sir. Phil Housley. So, uh, very good. Let's get back to the, the jersey itself. So, there you are. Very nice. <laughs> oh, Big Al says that. The Sabres. Congrats, Larry. There you go, Larry. Congratulations. Like I said, you're definitely definitely on a heater, too. So I know a lot of you guys are on a bit of a heaters. So it's up to the rest of you guys to kind of edge in there and, and knock them around, though. So, yeah. So, yeah, I understand, Dale. Definitely. I've been I've been in cold spells myself for many, many times. But, yeah, I watch people that are getting their heaters, and it's amazing. Obviously, you know, Larry and, and Devin and – and Big Al, you guys are right now. Mike H, you guys are on pretty cool hot streaks. It's always nice to be on a hot streak, but it's you got to be able to withstand those cold streaks to 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 get to those hot streaks. But congratulations, Larry! Very good, very nice Hall of Famer, Buffalo Sabers, Phil Housley. Can't disrespect Housley, so big time. I think it's an obviously now he's been a head coach too, so he's still in the still in the eye. Obviously, Phil Housley is is pretty pretty well regarded across the NHL. So congratulations to you. Yeah, probably you're frozen. I know definitely know how you feel. So we'll see. We'll see what comes up tomorrow with the pick your player. Like I said, 32 boxes. You know, you got one box you got one in 32 chance. You got two, you got you know one in or one in 16 of hitting if you have two spots tomorrow. So we'll see what happens tomorrow. Good luck to everybody with that. I did I appreciate the support for this. Like I said I have one more of these AJ's boxes we'll do next Wednesday. We'll see what comes out of there. See if we can. Obviously, it'd be nice to. It's nice not to have a Canadian come out the first after the first two. So we got Buffalo in there as well. So we shall see what happens next week. Thank you much for everybody for that. And I said I'm looking forward to possibly grabbing those frameworth boxes. I'll keep you posted 
you know, over the next couple of break nights, what my situation is with those. But congratulations to Larry again. Really nice. With our hump day, AJ's uh, mystery box break. So I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thank you very much. Thank you, everybody. Thank you, Dale. I will, or thank you, Devin. Thank you, Larry. Thank you, Big Al. Thank you, Derek. I'll see there it is. Nice hit. So then we can't disrespect Phil Housley. Then time you get a nice Hall of Famer on a nice licensed, you know, white Buffalo Reebok jersey. You know, there's nothing, no, nothing to shake a stick at. So congratulations to that. So I'll see you guys tomorrow night. Thank you much, everybody. Talk to you then. Take care.